Hi, so I don't know about you guys, but whenever I go to the beach, no matter how well I dust myself off, have a shower or wash my clothes, for the next year, I'll be randomly finding sand everywhere. <laughs> but... What the hell? And it got me thinking, you know in action movies they're always, you know, putting tracking devices under people's cars or in their bodies? Why don't they just chuck sand on them next time they see them? Secret agent life revolutionized. Your mission. Andrea Magnific Chagola has killed the last three agents that we've sent after her. Known associates? Not quite sure yet, maybe a receptionist, but up to you to find out. Thank you, ma'am. Oh, an agent? I want this one. Make sure you visit the professor. She's slippery. Understood. On another mission then, agent. Of course, I only get the call half an hour before. Nonetheless, three pieces for you to take. Number one, looks like normal perfume. However, it acts like a deadly spray to anything that touches its mist. So, do be careful with that one. Not too shabby, Professor. Trusty pen. But it's poison. No, uh, pepper sp I'll let you finish. Based off uh, one of my favorite fountain pens, but be careful with this one as well. <coughs> Wouldn't want to be writing to mother with that one, but um, I do have for you something very exciting the most powerful tracking device to date. No, they're gonna let me use it? Oh yes, I uh, pulled a few strings for my favorite agent. Let's see what we have here. Sand. Be careful with this agent. You'll never get this shit off of you. And then those chase scenes would end so much faster. I've got it. Hey, Shigola! Oh, shit! And... Sand. 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 Oh, I give up. This is disgusting. There's like sand everywhere. I can't get it out. Well, that's all right. Because where you're going, life's a beach. Oh, sorry. Hello? Agent, did we get her? Yeah, I've got her right here. Excellent. Did you use that beach line? Uh-huh, yeah, I did, I did. Yes, did she laugh? Not really, no. What? Well, I'm not sure she got it. <laughs> well, that got dramatic. But you know, sometimes I enjoy finding sand in myself because it's like, you know, you see it and you remember. It's like your sand child. You see it, you remember the good times you had, it travels with you. You know what? As I say it out loud, I'm realizing it's not really a thought I should share with people. Yeah. Comparing sand to children. The online series of a woman in her late 20s. No, I apologize. If you missed it, I put up a video a couple of Fridays ago and you should check that one out because it ends a lot less awkwardly than this one is right now. It's my favorite sand child of my two sand children. Uh, thank you for your feedback on my last video as we go into porno music slash comment time. I will make the comments slightly larger. Sorry, I'm traveling at the moment, by the way, which is why the background's different. A couple of you asked me if my handshake had to be practiced. I put this up on my Facebook and Twitter, but just to give you a quick peek. Enter secret handshake. Oh, sorry, sorry, that was an awkward touch. Come on, make my hand. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> Please enter secret handshake. <laughs> she got very nervous then. Why are your hands sweaty? And also, I was asked if I was making fun of people who lose their virginity in their 20s in my last video. For those of you who haven't watched it, you're like, what the hell was that last video about? No, I wasn't making fun of you. If I had my own way, I wish we were all asexual robots. So, you know, I don't care when you lose your virginity, as long as you're thinking about me. All right, this maybe is my least favorite sad child. <laughs>